The time limit in this world is 2,592,000 seconds before and after the story. The range of active area of this world is every section of storyline map from Mr. Ebbett, the falling place, to the ending. Other than that range, will be disconnected from this world. This world is a complete world. After the ending, there is no signs of timeline disconnection. And after stopping Frisk from falling, there is no trace of interference from other players too. But it seems like Reset was pressed by someone. I have to find the cause of disconnection. Bringing back dead NPCs in the story will lead straight to the hacker's ending, but continuing the game as Frisk won't. So to this world, it doesn't matter who is moving the plot. What does matter is that there is a player doing this. Is player the cause that led to Reset? Or is it because I am the player? So, let us try again. Frisk. The link with this fun value world line has been disconnected. The link with this fun value world line has been disconnected. The link with this fun value world line has been. The link with this fun value world. The link with this fun. The link with this fun value world line has been disconnected. The link with this fun value world line has been disconnected. The link with this fun value world line has been disconnected. Determination. Should I just better give up? Player had once again stopped Frisk's fall, and then time goes by meaninglessly. Just don't go to the ending. Then I won't be disconnected from this world. Everyone's living peacefully in the underground. It doesn't matter if the barrier is broken or not. Stop lying to yourself. What should I do? Human, don't you know how to greet an old Whoa. pal? Find the you. He disappeared suddenly. Mom baked a pie at home, but you didn't show up. I asked Sun to find you, and it turns out you were hiding in here. Next time you want to play alone outside, can you tell me beforehand? Sorry, I was just taking a little nap. Stop lying to yourself, what should I do? I know you are very depressed lately. Everyone can tell, and I'm very worried about you. You are my best friend. You can tell me anything. So don't be sad alone, okay? Asriel, I'm just... I felt like I'm excluded by this world. Is it better without me here? What are you saying? You are a great magician! If you didn't use magic to bring me back to life, I would still be a flower that can't feel love! I can't bring Chara back to life. I'm the one who make them can't wake up. How about Chara? I'm already trying to move on. Now you are my family. Talking to you makes me feel much better. But I don't want Tori to see my crying face. Can you help me get the pie? I will go right now. Don't you go anywhere. Wait until I come back. Hmm. Your expression. That's the expression of a human who lied. Thanks so much for pointing that out for me right now. You're the human who decides this world's future. I waited for you at the corridor for a long time, but you didn't show up. I don't think human's determination will be enough to keep you going. Unless there's something stopping you from making decisions. More or less. Your LV. I can pretend I didn't see that. Hmm. From your reaction, you do know its meaning. I did not witness all that. I don't know how you did it. Maybe you killed all of humanity. That doesn't matter, since you didn't hurt any monsters in Underground. Ah, so I won't judge you. <sighs> but your LV is still going up. The rise of LV usually makes people become distant from themselves. So the less their souls will hurt. The higher the LV is, the more difficult to get hurt. But your true self and your soul nearly overlapped. You're being honest to yourself. Which means your soul would feel love more easily than anyone else. And also, easier to get hurt. Then we only have one explanation. You're hurting yourself. The damage you did to yourself, saved up, caused your LV to increase. The damage from yourself makes your determination unstable. Maybe that's what it is. While you're in Underground, you're friendly to every monster. 
you become friends with every monster. However, you're not happy. When you're depressed, everyone can tell. So take care of yourself, because someone really cares about you. Mm. If you're done with talking, then just leave me alone. Your expression doesn't seem like this can be solved by gaping alone. Even after I talk so much, you still don't want to tell the truth. Seems like you don't see me as a friend. No, 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 sons. I don't want to see you as a friend. I, I am just... Then at least don't hide truth from friends. Always lying to friends, making them worrying about you. It's not what friends are supposed to do. I want to be a true friend to you. I want to be a true friend to everyone. So I promise you, I won't hide the truth from friends anymore. I will tell you everything. So you're saying you're not a human from this world? You replaced the human who would have fallen down and kill all the monsters just to save monsters and become friends with them. But once you break the barrier and free all the monsters, you'll be kicked out from this world. Yes. This is unbelievable. Actually, I can hardly believe what you're saying right now is the truth. You are the legendary fart master, or you are the doo-doo butt. Please stop making me say these, I hate these childish words. Although I did doubt you're a time traveler, it seems like you know many things. But I didn't detect any timeline jumps. Because right now, what I can jump through are not timelines, but fun. Alternative universes. Jumping through the timelines in the same universe, some entities might still remember things happening to them before the jump. But if you jump through alternative universes, those same entities are actually already different individuals. What other universes Sans had experienced, you won't remember a bit. Should I make a program so at least you can know about other timelines? That way it would be easier to explain. I kinda get your situation now. If you want my advice, I suggest you should end your journey in this world even for your own good. Since it's torture for you now, either staying at underground or breaking the barrier and going to the surface. So it's better just to let it end sooner. Although I don't want things to go this way. I don't want that too. I want to live with you guys after the ending as well. I really hate to let it end now. If it's me, I would have given up long ago. But maybe you would find a better way. Or you should just break the barrier at the start. Or get the reset from players. It's your decision, I'm just giving you advice as a friend. Even if you stop for a while, you'll still want to move forward. Right? I was afraid of being sent to the hacker's ending, or being disconnected right away, so I didn't do anything extreme. I can try. Let's go break the barrier. No! I give up. If I can't reach the future, then let's create a future where everyone is happy, except for me. A true, perfect ending. Then I would be satisfied. I already made a mistake. I took away Frisk's happiness already. So, next time is the last time. The barrier has been destroyed. Sans, thank you. You made me determined. If I stay here any longer, it won't be good for me. Or everyone. Anonymous asked. I just learned that there's a genetic illness in my family. Because my newborn and only nephew has it. I pay like three hugs just to see all sons telling me it'll be okay. Hey buddy. It's going to be alright. Don't wrinkle your forehead. You're doing good all this time. Your heart is full of life and happiness. That's just a possibility. Stop for a moment. Let's watch the bright colors of the sky and admire the figures the foamy clouds gift us. Yeah. It's great to be alive. Enjoy your time here. Make others feel the same.